For millions of years, Earth was fertile and rich. Then pollution and waste began to take their toll. Civilization fell into ruin. This is the world of the 25th century. Only a handful of scientists remain who have vowed to rebuild what has been destroyed. This is their achievement. A mobile storehouse of scientific knowledge. Art II, manned by a highly trained crew of young people. Their mission, to help bring the hope of a new future to mankind. Art II log, entry number one. I, Jonah, Ruth, Samuel, and Adam are fully aware of the dangers we face as we venture into unknown, maybe even hostile areas. But we're determined to bring the promise of a new civilization to our people and our planet. Arctic Law, entry 405. I am now approaching a village where slavery is willing to exist. If the rumor proves true, our mission will be to put an end to this miserable and immoral practice. In this new world, we are helping to rebuild. There is no room for slavery. Jonah to Ark. This is Jonah calling the Ark. Yes, Jonah. This may be it. I think I see Baron Vargas. Can you give us your location? Just a minute. No water until you finish work. Please. I'm so thirsty. Back to work. Guards, make them work as late as possible today. The field must be ready for planting by the new moon. Finish in time, and I will give you two full days of rest. Now work. I'm actually looking at people who have become slaves. I better give you my location. I'm in sector six. Jonah! Jonah! Ruth, change the power on panel four. Jonah! Ah, he should be good for plenty of work. Hope you don't have too big an appetite. <laughs> them spying on us, Baron Vargas. Good. We can use another strong back. By what right do you keep these people in slavery? It has nothing to do with right. Only fear, my boy. Put him to work, Cyrus. We've lost him. Mm -mm. I'm not giving up that easy. Radar feedback from the Romer. Temperature from the heat sensor is good. Good? He's somewhere in area 64. Not much to go on. Not much to go on? Sam, you're a genius. Area 64, here we come.
What's your name? Shh. Gideon. Why did you come near the Baron's border? To help you and the others. No one can help us. Why? There's something you must understand about the Baron. He has magic powers. If a slave disobeys him, he takes that man and turns him into an animal. Well, that's impossible. Oh, no, we've seen it. He's turned Gideon's sister into a rabbit. He's done it to others. Then he takes them away and we never see them again. Well, there's so many of you. So few guards. Why haven't you banded together and thrown Vargas out? Every time we plan to escape, the Baron hears about it. There's a traitor among us, but we don't know who it is. What if I challenge the Baron? Would your people follow if I led? Yes. We all want to be free men again. I want to see this man's magic. When's the best time? On the way to the feeding. Spread the word to the others. If we do it quickly, maybe your traitor won't have time to tell the Baron about our plan. I hope so. Be careful. Do you see anything, Ruth? Not yet. Hey, wait a minute! What is it? Oh, the most beautiful sight in the world next to Jonah. Straight ahead, Samuel. We're getting close. Why are you two men talking? I asked where I could get some water. Water? There's no water until the work is done. You know that, Gideon. Why didn't you tell him? I forgot, sir. I'll have to remind you of our rules. You come with me. Now, tell me what's going on. Well, nothing, Baron Vargas. You weren't talking to the new slave about water. Yes. Yes, I was. Gideon, don't lie to me. I changed your sister into a rabbit. And I won't change her back into a human being unless you tell me everything. Just like you've always told me what the slaves are planning. Now, what'll it be? You do want to see your sister someday, don't you? Yes, sir. The new slave, Jonah, he'll lead the others against you tonight on the way to the feeding. Excellent. That's all I need to know, Gideon. You can go back now. And Gideon, I'm thinking of making you a guard. And I may even let you see your sister again. Wouldn't you like that? Yes, sir. to speak to you. Yeah! Yeah! Baron Vargas! Who dares shout and demand my presence? Jonah dares. And I speak for all of us. Yeah! Yeah! We're here to say that we will no longer obey you or your guards. No. No. Is that right, Jonah of the Ark? No man has a right to hold other men as slaves. No! no. no. 
Are you coming up here to challenge my power? Yes. From now on, these people are all free men and women! Yeah! I've heard enough. Come one step closer, my friend, and I'll turn you into a bird. You'll be like a chicken in a coop for the rest of your life. Ask them, they know! Come on, Gideon. Gideon, are you with me? Don't do it, Jonah. No, 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 no. Jonah. Your days as a tyrant are over. They are not. Hello, Jonah of the Ark. I warned him, didn't I? Never disobey Baron Vargas. Guards! Don't even feed them slop tonight. Take them away! Take one more look, you animals! And shriek before the power of Baron Vargas. a stunt. He's not fooling anybody. He's fooling them, unfortunately. Not for long. Ten to one, Jonah's under that platform. So that's what you think, eh? You sure you don't want to talk about this? I love good conversation. Uh... <laughs> young people dressed like that new slave Jonah. You idiots, you let them get away. Well, they'll be back. This time be ready for them. Or it will not go well with you. Yes, sir. I've got to tell you, that Baron Vargas really scares me. I just hope we can pull this one off. We've got to. Do you want to go over the scan again, or do you have it memorized? I got it memorized. How about you, Adam? Can you take care of your end? Because if they catch you, we've had it. They never catch me. This what I do. Okay. Did you reprogram the force field activator? Yep. This is gonna make the Baron's head spin around. If Vargas uses his magic to keep people locked up, we'll use our magic to set them free. Let's go. Good morning, my fine feathered friend. How is your chicken coop? I've had worse. Aren't you risking it? Letting people see me? I told my slaves and my guards that I'm giving you one more chance as a human being. <laughs> and by the way, we almost caught your friends yesterday. If I do catch them, I plan to sell all of you off separately to other villages. So that's how you really make people disappear. Exactly. 
<laughs> Wait till I tell your slaves. They'll never believe you. I tried to convince him. Gideon. Hello, Jonah. You're the informer. On the contrary, he's a loyal subject. Say hello to your sister, Gideon. <laughs> Gideon, why? I have to do what he says, or I'll never see my sister again. I saw what he did to you. He did nothing. It's a trick. Help me get out of here, and I'll show you. You can't defeat him. He has magic. That's exactly what he wants you to believe. He keeps you enslaved through your own superstition. You must fight your fear. Otherwise, none of you will be free. Gideon! Adam. You there. You know the rule. Away from there. Cyrus. Who is that little one? I've never seen him before. I don't know. Hey, little man. Come over here. Go get him. Stop those others. <laughs> Try over there. Guards! Find them. Give us some power over Vargas. Good thinking, Samuel. Could work. As long as I can get some help from my friend Gideon. Help me. I will not turn him back into a human. This time, I will make an example of him so that all of you... Friends, the Baron is an evil trickster. He has no real power, only the ability to create fear in his fellow man. Come up here and we'll see, Mr. Rockman. Should I step right here, Baron? Oh. See, nothing happens. Just a trap door, some smoke, and some birds fly out. Come closer, my friend, and we'll see how brave you are without your flying machine. Throw the net! No, Gideon! Help me! Gideon, throw the net! <laughs> Capture him! <laughs> Thank you. 
Now it's time for some of my magic, Baron Vargas. Force field, don't fail us now. How's this trick, Baron? and the others you sent away. In a scavenger camp, downriver. We'll get them back. Now that you know Vargas for what he really is, he can no longer do you any harm. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And now for my last trick. <laughs> Arc 2 log, entry 406. The people of the village are free again. They know now that only their own superstition and fear kept them enslaved. Never again will they allow one man to control their lives. For unlimited power in the hands of one man makes him a tyrant and slaves of us all. <laughs> <laughs>